Macron. Monsieur. Yes. Comment allez-vous? Très bien. Oui. Uh, pay, uh, how do I call that? Uh, patience. Uh, how do I say that? Demande la patience. Patience. And patience means? Patience. Okay. So, I believe, I know, since I've had some of it, uh, I believe it uh, uh, is very tasty. Okay. And you have two wines here. The other wine is called ISA. 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 Okay. Isa. What is Isa? Is it Isa mean something? It's for Isabel, the, the wife of the winemaker. All righty. And where is this wine being made? The Isabel? Isa? Sure. It's, uh, this is in the Côte de Tong, which is in the Languedoc in southern France. And it's uh, getting close to Spain, sort of in the pre-Pyrenees mountain ranges. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. And the same with... Passions. Passions is from uh, the Costière de Nîmes, which is uh, it's the Languedoc, but it's really right on the border of the Languedoc and Provence. So uh, it's pretty different, more like a Provence-styled rosé, very close to Avignon, so in that classic Provence kind of area. And uh, we're here on uh, uh, let's see, 83rd Street and Columbus Avenue, right across from the school. That has, I will say, a great double feature. The Minions are uh, playing over there. Uh, tomorrow night and uh, and uh, inside out oh that inside out it's you got to be go with a little kid could explain it to you it's so intellectual so uh, what's good news for you sir uh, good news for me is it's getting warm and everyone wants to drink rosé when it's warm and it reminds us of southern France when it's warm and eating food like this like anchovies and cheese and bread and salami and yeah the chef 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 the chef has, this is serious stuff, like the, everything has something more than something else. Like the anchovy is, uh, the anchovy has a crazy, yeah, what's the name of the place? Gastronomy 490. Gastronomy, and the Upper West Side here, our uh, home turf, and that's Gorgonzola, I can't wait to get that. What a nice spread you made here. It's a beautiful thing. So my last question is the following, because we're very involved with world peace. And we have a concert here in Central Park, Times Square, and the concert venue. And all worldwide, all the countries, including France, has agreed to have a day of peace, September 21st, United Nations Day. Okay. And, and the patience is a good uh, way to maintain peace in the world, because if you're patient with each other and yourself to begin with, and then others, uh, you're more than likely uh, going to be uh, having a good time. So I think so. So I ask thousands of people, what, is, uh, what does peace mean to them? Do you mind answering that? Okay, what does peace mean? Peace mean, to me means uh, everyone accepting each other's differences and getting along and uh, setting aside the differences to live in harmony. And your name again, sir? Nick. And Nick, do you guys have a website? Yeah, jennyandfrancois.com. How do you spell that? J-E-N-N-Y-A-N-D. F R A N C O I S dot com. Now, this music, I didn't have to like do it, it just kind of happened up there somewhere. It's all good. Thanks, Nick. Sure.